What's going on everyone and welcome back to Dying Light 2. So in the last episode we took this beautiful water tower. Oh shit. Yeah we took the we took the water tower. Um and we had a choice whether we were gonna give the water control to the peacekeepers or to the survivors. We chose the survivors because obviously now we've unlocked um this brand new if I go to the map. We've unlocked this brand new little thing down here where if we give a certain thing to, you know, whether it be to the peacekeepers or survivors, survivors are going to help us with parkour stuff like putting airbags around and zip lines and landing bags. Um, but the peacekeepers will give us like traps and, you know, all this stuff and also a crossbow, which I kind of want. Um, but yeah, so overall, I don't think. It's going to be too useful. I feel like I'm going to probably try and get the crossbow on the peacekeepers, but the survivors just going to look way more useful, you know, just to get around. Um, but yeah, so we are about to... Uh, shit. We're about to finish off just by heading to over here um, and finish the water tower mission because we didn't do it in the last episode, so yeah. make our way over here um obviously as you can see there's a lot more zip lines like thrown about because of the option that we chose um there's more zip lines everywhere so that's really it's really useful you know it's definitely going to be more useful through here um Sophie and her men near the so the place should be empty now. But I don't know when they'll be yeah. not sure why it's skipping the dialogue. Um but alright. Damn the shits were not durability pretty fast. We'll start using this for now. Alright, looks like we're sliding down here then this shit is. You. All right. There's also a little thing over here that we could definitely do with. Oh, actually, this is where we came before, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, this is where we came before to try and uh. Shite. Stand up here. Yeah, this is where we came before, and we just fell down because we didn't have enough stamina. But we've just upgraded our stamina last episode, so. We should hopefully be able to do a pretty. We got stuck on this last time too. We should be able to do a pretty decent job. Oh, we just stuck. All right. We should be able to get up there now to actually get this uh, safe house. Oh, it's better to have these safe houses anywhere we can. Oh no, this we didn't fuck anything up last time. We just oh uh, we. Yep, we just fucked that up last time. We. Didn't need stamina, we just couldn't make that. <laughs> well, we've done this time, that was nice and easy. Turn this generator on, and we will get some parkour XP as well as everything else. 250, I'll take that. Holy fuck, how do we get over there? Should we just make a fucking huge jump for it? I'm kind of thinking that's what we need to do. Oh, no. Oh, oh. This thing. Alright, nice. Let's see if there's anything up this airdrop. Let me just do that. Then whatever this is going to for. Access key. Is this something extra? Some military tech. Okay. An inhibitor somewhere. Fuck, how do I get on? <laughs> Over here? Yeah. Shit. Okay. Not sure where the inhibitor is. We'll have to figure out before we decide if we're gonna get it or not. It's in here, of course it is. Or maybe it's not, I don't know, is it on the roof? 
Because they're getting further away from it. Must be. Fuck. Okay. Uh, climb up this one then. Shit. How the fuck do we get up there? Let's see. Uh, looks like we actually have to. That's not very fucking useful, is it? Dumb. We cannot fucking do get out of this place. How the fuck do we- wait, 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 Because we can't actually- I mean, we can't get up there. Unless we- Oh, wait, can we climb this bit? Can we climb these? No, how the fuck do we get up there? Um... This way. Right. That was annoying. Can't believe it made us climb all the- No, we actually can't. Okay, so we do have to- Hmm. I'm not even sure how to start, to be honest with you. Nah, this is fucked. I'm not gonna be able to do this. Nope, that's not happening. Um, are we really gonna have to climb all the way up here? Just to fucking get over there, are you joking me? It's actually looking that way. Which is very annoying. <laughs> I can't believe I actually haven't done this. Right. Try and grab this roll. There we go. That was a fucking pain in the ass, wasn't it? Anyway. Easy lockpick. That's fair. That's in here. Seems a little bit easy that it's just like out in the open for us. I don't trust it. And I can actually upgrade again. Sick. Hold up. Straight away. Obviously we can do health no. We're gonna try and keep it even, you know. Um what have we unlocked here? Block charge. That's pretty cool. Stop. All too well performing a takedown. Is it quicker or? Yeah. Let's say it's just quicker. We've almost ranked up our um, parkour actually. Well, I'm glad we managed to grab ourselves. Holy shit, there's fucking bottles everywhere, man. That ain't no proof. Hmm. This is obviously something to do with. Let's see if we got anything in here. Some alcohol there. Take that. Take that. Rags, scraps, all useful stuff. Alright, let's see what's behind here. Dark zone. Oh, we actually have si we have six minutes on our um thing now, which is obviously really fucking good. We have six minutes of uh, dark zone time immunity. That's it. There we go. Is this some kind of collector or what? 
something down there. Yep. Here's something. That's one of the peacekeepers' tattoo symbols. Wait, what the hell? Oh fuck! That's oh that's human skin. Hakon, I found the tattoo they cut out of Lucas. Damn freaks. What? Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Get the hell out of there. We still ain't Doran. Why are you going through my sister's stuff? Didn't know they were hiring pilgrims as housekeepers. Oh, fuck off, mate. Are you shedding skin, Barney? What the fuck is... We didn't... A little piece of Lucas to remember him by, you sicko. Fuck you. Nice try. But that ain't mine. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Aiden, just let please let us kill him. Yes, thank fuck. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck yourself. Fuck you, you idiot. Come on, come on, come on, pussy. Holy shit, he's fucking me up. Nice. Ah, oh, wish it'd let us kill him though. Piece of shit. Stop it! What's going on here for fuck's sake? Are you nuts? He's he's setting us up. This fucking pilgrim is framing us. What is he talking about, Aiden? I found the proof. Hidden among your things. Proof? A of what? You cut the tattoo from Commander Lucas's arm. After his death, or when he was still alive. You're out of your mind. I didn't do it. Maybe you didn't. But your crazy brother... Barney's not a psycho. Mm -hmm. We have nothing to do with Lucas's death. I'm going to aid her. I've got the proof he's looking for. Aiden, it's not us. Nobody at the bazaar will believe you. Fuck that, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. This is between you and Aider now. Wait! Oh, Please. wait, no. Ador doesn't care about the truth. He doesn't care about finding the real killer. He's only looking for a reason to raid the bazaar. It's not my war, Sophie. No. But you'll have blood on your hands. Blood of innocence. Someone is setting us up. Someone clever. We're not sadists who would skim Lucas, Aiden. And you know it. But I know that you want to get rid of the PKs. Yes. And we will get rid of them. But not like psychos and assassins, Aiden. Believe me, this is a setup. Uh. I'll help you get to the center. I promise. How? By getting rid of the biggest problem of this land. The PKs. <sighs> that seems dangerous. What well, she's doing we'll is turning it around. Oh, fuck one. I'll tell you everything when I'm ready. Stay close to your radio, Aiden. Time to make some changes around here. I really wanted to kill her brother as well, that's pissed me off. No bad. Oh, I fucking hate him. Wait for Sophie's got her, it's sick. Fucking let me out of here. Mate, looks like I'm just hanging around waiting for Sophie's call. In the meantime, let's have a look real quick. Um, stolen goods, find Teresa. That's a side mission, and it is lots of fucking XP. So let's do that one. Hey, where is Teresa? That's pretty cool. Didn't expect to do that, but you know, whatever. Okay, I don't know if we'll be able to make it up here, to be honest. Come on. That's it. Hey, where is she? Where is she? 150. Down. 
not the least of my worries. And what is? Where is Teresa? Lavender, honey, honey, mushrooms, blah blah blah. Been cool chopping tool right there. Up some of them. Maybe we got Teresa is over here somewhere. Straight back up. Let's get this shit out of the way. Oh, we got in the water tower here. Yeah. Let's try and find a way in. Fucking hell. I'm back to the ticks and. I'm sure. Alright. So, how the fuck do I get in here? <laughs> I've climbed this. Really? Hold oh, that just to get in. I'm Teresa, right. Good night, Did you see that? Elvira stripped naked and stepped under the faucet. Um. Actually, you know what? This woman can fix my tools. UV bar, blah blah blah. Craft parts. Upgrade. Can I not like upgrade? Can I not like fix one of my weapons? No? Damn it, sucks. Alright. Um. I guess I'm just gonna have to. Oh, this is Teresa. Okay. Good Hello, Teresa. Have I already thanked you for. For the water. I hear you were robbed. But my best friend, no less. I'm devastated. Really. And why on earth would you jump to that conclusion about your best friend? I didn't want to. But who else could it be? She was storing it for me. To keep it safe, she said. And now, it's conveniently gone. Me and my boy are left with nothing. If only she'd admit mm. it and return the flower, I'd forgive her. I swear I would. Lord is my witness. If she's in trouble, I'll help her. But she's a stubborn one. We've had quite a harvest, too. Wouldn't have had us living on Easy Street, but now... Now we'll starve. This girl seems quite nice. Do you have any proof that Anna did this? Not exactly, but was in her shed, wasn't it? In here, I thought she was doing me a favor offering to store it. Turns out, she was just making it easier for her to screw over me and my boy. <sighs> Talk to her, would you? She won't listen to me. A right. stranger could get around her stubbornness. We can put this behind us if she gives it back. And if she stole it because she was hungry, she can keep what she needs. Oh, this, 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 this woman's Please actually really, really... She's very, um, she's very nice. Let's have a look. Talk to Anna. Hey, Anna. Anna. I just want to talk. Go away. Come on. Talk to me and I'll go away. It won't take long. Look, there's been 11 years I know Teresa sent you. Fuck her. And fuck you. Whoa. No need for that. <laughs> Come on. Aiden, this is Sophie. Oh, Sophie's. Come to the bazaar. We're having a powwow. A powwow? Ready to get me yeah. to the center? I'll tell you everything when you get here. Hurry up. Alright. Hmm. Well, right now. Fuck no. She's not gonna let me in? Alright, it looks like I'm gonna have to go up top then. Get in from above. I didn't want to go all the way to the top, but whatever. Can I get inside? Make it easier to get a little bit lower down. 
Yep, alright. Um, little tape there. Fuck's sake. What's up, fella? People are actually being nice to me now, it's quite interesting. Okay. Right. Surely there has to be some other door or window to get in. Maybe up here? Hold up. I'm not really not climbing this. Oh, I can. Okay. Aha! Right! Hold on. Please, just go away. Can we please talk? I'd like to help. Help what? Remind me I'm a widow? Or, or that I'm dirt poor? Or a heinous flower thief? I'm not making assumptions. I just want to hear your story. I want to hear the truth. The truth? You want the truth? Here's the truth. I would never rob a friend. Never. And that's the end of my story. Did Teresa tell you about the half year's wages she owes me? I needed Teresa to sell that flower so she could pay me. Why would I risk everything? My well-being, Teresa, and her sons, by stealing it. Hmm. Hey. She'd mentioned you were storing the flower. I figured it was the best way to keep watch over it, make sure I got paid. So we put it in my shed near the tower. I went to check on it this morning and nothing. All gone. You didn't right. see anyone lurking nearby or anything suspicious? You don't think I would have mentioned that by now? I can only tell you that I did not steal that flower. I wouldn't do that to Teresa or to myself. The only strange thing was that nothing else was stolen. My buckwheat, my beets, untouched. Hmm. Whoever it was only wanted the flower. Interesting. Mind if I go check out the shed? Maybe it just needs to be looked at with a fresh pair of eyes. Knock yourself out. Okay. People this close shouldn't hurt each other. What the hell is going on in the central loop since PK restricted access? All right, let's have a look. All these clues inside. All right. Doors unlocked. Nothing's broken. Someone was very familiar with this place. <gasps> Maybe it was the sun. That's what I'm getting. Maybe the sun. And footprints. Huh? One set of shoes. Thief worked alone. The rest of the supplies are untouched. They knew exactly what they were looking for. Yeah, my guess is that it was Teresa's son, maybe, because... You know, someone who knows the place, someone who's very familiar, they knew that he was in there. You know, all that, it kind of adds up to... Any clues on the outside, maybe? On the back? Nope. Like a... It definitely has to be inside. Actually, what about... on the door? Um... I know we haven't missed anything in here. Sorry. Hmm. What about if I climb on top of the shed? There's some clues up here.
Hold up. Can't go in there. Thought I'd got myself stuck there. Oh, flower trail on the ground. Bags dragged this way. Keep following it. So it has to be to the right or the left. Who had the keys to the shed? Me and my husband. A husband, right? But he's dead. Nobody else? You sure? There's no sign of forced entry, Anna. Whoever took the flower had the keys. Or made copies. So you do think it was me? Uh, we won't pin the blame on us straight away. Calm down and think. Who else would do this? And why? Help me help you. Unless Teresa's right after all. Hard to tell. Someone from the bazaar, perhaps? There's Dodger. That guy's capable of anything. And then there's Benny, Teresa's son. And that's all I can come up with. Yeah, that's all I'm thinking, Benny. How did you mention Teresa's son? What about Teresa's son? Why would he do this? Normally I wouldn't suspect him. Nice kid. I've known him all his life. He's like a son to me. But lately he's been quiet. Like he's got something to hide. And maybe he does. Mm. But no, Benny wouldn't have done this. It would break Teresa's heart and he knows it. And even if he had taken the flower, why? To sell that it? seems to be the central question for everyone involved. Where can I find Benny? Not sure. He's been making himself pretty scarce. That said, I'm sure Teresa's got him guarding their storehouses. Make sure what meager goods they have left are safe. I'll look for him. Hmm. Okay. Um. What did you do when you found out the flowers? Can you tell me where you were the night the flower was stolen? Morning, my husband. That night? Like every night since I lost him. I'm sorry for your loss. Okay, yeah, I was just gonna say I'm we sure just dug ourselves something deep Let's there. Get this over with. <laughs> Why did you mention Why Dodger? Would this Dodger character steal the flower. Haven't a clue. Other than it's just the kind of thing I'd expect from a shady guy like him. His uh, kind never he's, dirty their hands with he's, work. He's too they obvious. Just sit there, living large of others' misfortune. But I I Anna, hey. Got carried away. Sorry. I only just lost my husband, and it still hits me at random times. <clears throat> Sorry, where was I? Oh, right. So, Dodger kept asking Teresa about her harvest, her, her grain, how much, etc. I, I didn't think much of it at the time. I try not to pay attention to scum like that. If you want to talk to him, mm. you'll find him at the bazaar. But watch your back. He doesn't give a rat's ass about people. Only money. Okay, so accusations are devastating enough for him. Hmm. I'm ruined. And not if we find the flower and prove it was someone else. Perhaps. But in my experience, the damage has been done. Maybe, maybe not. Let's see what I can find out. Alright. So what I'm thinking is maybe that I Dodger got in uh Therese in uh that. maybe that Dodger got into Benny's head and he actually got Benny to steal the flower, that's my guess. But um yeah, we're gonna leave it there. Hope you all enjoyed, like, subscribe and uh, see you next time.